guys welcome to today's video and thanks for joining me so we're going to carry on with the altered file folder what I've done off camera is I where did I got up to I think it was just these papers wasn't it I've covered the pockets with papers and I've just put a little thumb notch in the top of them um, I have stuck the envelopes in they're all stuck in ready to use like that so I'm just going to add a little bit of embellishment I've also made the journal well I've got it ready to stitch I've just put three pieces of patterned paper from the kit and some coffee dyed paper so that's ready to be stitched in so we'll do that in a minute so let's just put a little bit of embellishments on on the file folder now in the video where I showed you Anna's Christmas kits there was one for these window pockets so I'm going to use a few of these I'm just going to trim that down that end it's still got a little bit of white showing so I'm going to put a few of these pockets in um, I'm not going to cut out the window I'm just going to stamp I think or put a sentiment on there I don't want to cut out that pocket so let's have a look where we can put one so I thought we could put one in the front here my, I, I have scored them on my scoreboard just to make them easier to, you know, to um, to fold up. Let me just make sure, is that the right way? Yeah, like that. So I'm going to glue that down. They're really easy to put together. They're quite self-explanatory, really. If you just go over, you know, with your scoreboard, it makes it easier to fold, to, to fold them in. So I'm just going to put some... Okay, so let's fold that over. If you want to cut out the windows in the pockets, if you've got this kit, then you know you can do that. But I just want mine as little pockets like that. So I'm going to put it underneath there so it's something else when you open it. So let's just um, try to think whether I want to put a little thumb notch in. I think I do. I'm just going to look for my little hole punch. I'm just going to use this one. This is just a little scalloped one. Yeah, just like that. So I'm going to stick that down. I don't think I'm going to have it as a top there, or should we? No, because I don't want anything hanging up there. So I'm just going to stick this down. But if you want to have it as a top, just do just do your three sides. But I'm going to glue all over mine and stick it down. I just wanted to try and show you a few of the bits from each of the kits now you could work with them so that is that on there just keep it pressed down for a little minute and then I've got one of the tag kits that uh, that she done I've cut them all out here ready um, I don't know whether to put one on the front of there or whether to put one in here because I think that's quite bulky enough, isn't it? I think I'm going to put one in here. How many much room have I got inside? Um, should I put one there? Well, we've got enough. I could do. Maybe put one of these. Yeah, like I said, I've already scored them with my scoring board. So they're easy to fold over. Just glue together. Like so, yeah, I think I'm going to put one on the inside as well. So let's just glue that down. I mean, you can embellish it however you want to. You don't have to do it the same as me if you've got these kits. I know a few people I've spoke to, I've bought them after I showed the kits. So if you've got them, this is just an idea of a little way how to use them. You can, you know, if I'd have had more time, I would have probably made a journal with them, but we're coming to the end of November soon so yeah I'll be starting on the December daily soon so I didn't want to start another journal and not be able to finish it I've got some winter projects lined up to do so I just thought we'd do this little project with these kits let's just glue that down Stick that on there. Should be able to fit a little tag in there or something. I don't know what to put on the front there. Maybe a sentiment or something. 
yeah we've got those little sentiments that I showed you at the beginning haven't we so I'm not going to put anything on there I want to put something on the front and I've got a piece of one of my snippet rolls and I thought I'd just stick that on the front there I thought that would look quite nice on the front okay let's just pop that there put a merry christmas there we could do that one or we could use one of these words let's have a look um let's just cut some of these off let's see which looks the best These might look better because they're all matching, aren't they? Um, that one, that merry and bright, or that one? No, I think the merry and bright goes better with the kit, doesn't it? Let's use that. So let's just put a little bit of ink around here. this on oops following everywhere right let's just stick that on there like that okay so that's the front and then we're going to put something in this pocket I'm going to put another sentiment at the top up there what shall we put this Christmas one or shall we put happy holidays let's put happy holidays too much on because I don't want it very dimensional so I'm going to stick that just there I am going to put some lace around the spine so I might need to move that over a little bit yeah I think let me just get my lace I can't decide whether to put this lace down or whether to put this crocheted lace down we'll have a look at that in a minute right so we've got that we've got that um want to put anything on here no i don't think so i think i'm just going to leave that although i could put another pocket there really couldn't i and then whoever gets it can yeah can put whatever they want to in there so let's just get another one of the pockets let's get this one let's just fold this over yeah, so there's paper kit, there's a pocket kit, there's a tags kit, there's the words, um, there's the Christmas cards, there's a kit for matching envelopes for the Christmas cards. So she's got some lovely kits out at the moment and there are some really nice ones if you're looking for something. Um, yeah, I'm just going to put a little thumb notch in there. Okay, and then we'll stick that extra pocket there. Might as well use them, might not I? While we've got them, I've got them cut out. Okay, stick that down there. And then we want to stick something on the front there, don't we? We were going to stick a couple of words on there, wasn't we? Or should we stick something else on? Uh, like the, you can cut out of these, but I don't want to. I'm just wondering whether to just stick some more words on them, I think. Let's have this one with Christmas. me put that on so I'm just going to stick Christmas there 
and then we'll put something else on this one what shall we have peace on earth let's have that one or oh, joy to the world uh, we'll have peace on earth I think she's only just put these on her Etsy shop these words well I've only just seen them they weren't there when I showed you the uh, papers and the tags and that so I think it's just an addition that she's added on but the Christmas cards are nice and the matching envelopes like I said I'm hoping to get on and do a few of them on camera with you so there we go so that's the front we've got that bit there I'm going to leave that I think or do we think I should put a pocket on there and might as well might now I've got the pockets and then whoever gets it can do what they want with it then can't they I've got another one here have this one let's just fold that over first are you all okay guys what have you been up to have you been crafting what are you what are you working on are you still doing your Christmas journals I'm not sure whether you'll have seen the flip through of my Christmas one yet but I think you'll have seen it by the time this video goes up yeah you will have seen it so I really enjoyed making that one I really did really really did enjoy making it I've loved I love Christmas crafting I love making anything to do with Christmas so I just want to put them cards together and then I'll be getting ready for December daily to start which I can't wait oh there's a little bit of yeah, I can't wait to do the December daily. Yeah, I might as well stick them on there, might now whilst I've made them. And then they can be a little... It'd be nice for a little December notebook because you can put all your receipts in, your lists in. And then the little journal that I'm going to put in. You can document bits and pieces if you want to, can't you? So, yeah. Right, let's have this one. We'll have Joy to the World. So like I said guys at the beginning, I'm going to give this away but I'm really sorry I can only do UK uh, subscribers at the moment just with the prices of postage and Christmas round the corner and whatnot. Um, so if you want to be in, a, in with a chance of winning this, just leave me a comment. I want you to be a subscriber but just leave me a comment, any comment will do, it doesn't matter what you put, just leave me a comment in the comment section but you must be a subscriber an active subscriber um, yeah and then I will do the draw I'm not too sure when I'm putting the video up but I'll do it a week after the date that I put the video up yeah for the winner and then I'll pop it in the post to you ready for the start of December and then in case you want to just document a bit of December you can you can use this so yeah just leave me a little comment underneath and I do apologize for international guys it's just I just can't afford the postage at the moment but on my 3000 giveaway we'll definitely be doing something for everybody so yeah okay so that is that so we've got there we've got pocket 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 and then we've also got pockets in these as well so I'm going to open up and then we've got our envelopes um, we can put stuff in so I'm going to use this pocket I have scored this one I remember scoring it I'm going to put it on there I tried to keep the papers matching so it's been a nice little project to do this I've enjoyed putting this together actually yeah I will leave a link like I said to the lady whose tutorial I watched in the beginning Brenda I'm sure her name was Brenda um, yeah I'll leave her I'll leave a link to her channel because she was very good at explaining as well. I just thought it was a nice project. Nice quick project. I thought it was coming undone at the bottom. Right, let's stick this down there. Put that on there like that and then it's matching that paper um, what shall we have we'll have tis the season 
these have come in really handy these words have here for this project oops cut the bits off around the edge of it, stick this down, stick that on there and then this pocket I'm going to stick on this little envelope here hopefully if it'll fit, I should do. handy there's another one so there's lots of little pockets on here and then should we put one on there as well we might as well if I've got another one left yeah I've got one more here so let's do this one as well we might as well might we Have you got your Christmas trees up yet guys? It is, what date is it today? It's Sunday, oh dear me, is it the 20th of November I think? 21st I think, something like that. Uh, we've not got ours up yet, the girls are mithering, can we put it up later? But it's a full day job really, <laughs> once you start isn't it? I don't know, I suppose we could get the tree out and get the tree up for them. Um, yeah, maybe, I'll see how I feel after. Um, it's only early in the morning now. I just wanted to get this video done and then they're ready to upload. So we've got lots of little flippy pockets. So what I'll do is I'll probably add some bits of ephemera to this, to this when I send it whoever wins it. I'm not going to put in the title that it's a giveaway video because I want people that generally watch my channel to be in with a chance of winning it, not just anybody who just says that they want to be in it and they don't really watch me. I don't think that's fair to my loyal subscribers, I don't. Right, I think that is it for pockets. We could put something here. Um, I'm just trying to think. Should I put a little pocket? No, I think I'm going to leave that page because by the time we've got the journal in, yeah, we'll leave that page. So I'm going to stitch my journal in now. Um, I was going to do elastic, but I've changed my mind. I'm going to do a binding. So I'm just going to do, I've got my uh, wax linen thread here and I've got my needle. You've seen me do this loads of times. I just measured three times the length of the journal of the file folder even. I don't know whether my needle will go through or whether I'll have to use my pokey tool. Right, let me just get that. Let's just move all these bits and pieces off my desk. Stitch the journal in and then we'll finish embellishing it. How long have I been on, guys? Oh, only 20 odd minutes. So, I'm going to... just want to make sure that's straight. a bit difficult to do because it's so wide. I'm just going to get my pokey tool. Where are you pokey tool? I'm just going to go through the middle, through the end. I'm 
come through this end. Watch your fingers at the other side, guys, because it flipping hurts if you put that pokey chill through it. Right, so down the middle, leave a tail hanging here so that you can tie it up through this end. To move everything. Where's the hole? Can't see the flipping. Oh, there we are. I've got it. Up through that end. Don't forget to leave your tail there. Down this end. And then back up the middle. Oops. Why are we not going through the middle? Okay, <laughs> it's because it's so many pieces, it's flapping around. Right, okay, so now you want to have a piece of your thread at each side of the, the journal like that. And then just pull it nice and tight and then just tie it off. like so and then I'm going to leave some little threads dangling just in case anybody wants to put anything on there let me just put that needle because if I lose that I'm lost without that big needle so there we go there's our little journal stitched in as well didn't take long did it let's have a look what it's looking like oh wrong way let's have a little flip through just see I'm just going to cut it off a little bit at the bottom there I don't want it hanging out the journal the elastic Right, okay, so we've got that bit with a pocket, we've got a pocket there, we've got a pocket there, we've got a pocket there, we've got a pocket at the top there, and we've got a pocket behind there, we've got a pocket there, we've got our little journal, and then we've got the pocket there, pocket there, pocket there, and a pocket on the back, so there's lots of little pockets in that, isn't there? So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some lace on, all as I'll be doing, guys, is I've not... I've got all the tags here that came with the tag kit. They're all cut ready, but I need to put twine or ribbon or something on them. So I'll be stuffing them in, stuffing them in the pockets and that. Um, I'm just going to use all these tags that I've got from the kit. Let's have a look what we've got. Uh, maybe I could. I don't like leaving the project so you can't see the end of it. Let's just get the tags. Maybe I could just put them in the pockets and then put some twine or something through them. Right, let's have a look what we've got for this one. Can I have that one in there? Can I have a couple in each pocket because there's so many? Put two in there. And uh, we've got a double one there. Put that in. And then a single one, put that in. And then we want something in the front here. <laughs> Got so many. I'll probably end up rearranging these. I'm just showing you now. Then you can just see all the pockets. So we've got that pocket there. And then we've got one behind. If you can see there, just behind the back. So let's put some a couple in there. Yeah, put two in there. So there's plenty of room for little receipts and different bits and pieces i really like that actually i do i'm quite pleased with this little project let's put some in there i don't want to add much more to it because i just wanted to show you using stuff from the kits um you know i could add embellishments and stuff like that i might add a few bits before i send it out to whoever wins it but um, yeah I'm going to put twine on all these oh I've missed a little thing off, off there let's just stick a little word on there we'll have this one deck the halls yeah I've got all sorts of stuff on my desk that I could embellish with but I just really wanted to show you the the kits that you how you can use them without having to have lots of other stuff stick that there let's 
put it straight okay so that's that oh we've not put one there neither <laughs> uh, which one should we have let's have that one mistletoe these have come in very very handy these have I'm not sure if Anna's still got a sale on. I meant to go on and have a look before I started the video. But like I said, I'll leave links to everything um, if you want to go and have a look. You can pop over and have a look yourself. I can't remember whether the sale's still on. You know, I would probably embellish the pockets a little bit more. But I just want to show you how you can use the kit, really. Uh, yeah, so... I don't think I'm going to put anything on there. I'm not going to put anything in these pockets, I don't think, because I'll let whoever gets the journal there good for receipts and that. So maybe we could stuff a couple of tags in there. But I think that's as much as I want to do on there. I just want to put some lace down the spine. Uh, now then, which one should we use, guys? Should we use this one here? Which is like an... I'm not sure whether that would cover it. Yeah, that one. Oh, now this is the problem because I can't hear what you're saying now. No, the other one. I like this one better. So I'm just going to put some glue on one side first. Okay, and then I'm going to get my lace. Stick it down there. I'm just going to give it a second just to, to grab. And whoever gets it can always embellish it a bit more if they want to. And then I'm just going to put some glue on the back and do the back side. Where's it going to go to? About there. Just give that a second and then I can cut it. Let's do it that way, cut it from the back. One side, let's cut this side. It's too long to fit on my desk. And there's that side. Let's have a little look. Yeah, that lace just finishes it off that little bit there at the sides, doesn't it? Just strengthen the spine a little bit. And we want something to tie it with. I found some lace here that is sort of the same colour as. as the uh, papers let's just see how much we need I'm just going to tie it in a little bow at the front so it was a nice quick project that and I thoroughly enjoyed putting it together I hope you've enjoyed watching let's just see what this will look like So if we don't need all that. Right, okay then, so we'll have a little flip through and then we're done, yeah? Um, so like I said, don't forget to leave me a comment if you want to be entered and then we'll do the drawer a week after um, the video goes up. So let's open it and have a look. So we've just got that little tie there. We've got these pockets, we've got a pocket there, we've got a pocket there and then we've got pocket, pocket, pocket and then we've got a pocket on the front that flips over there and we open this way with a pocket we open that envelope a pocket a pocket another pocket and another pocket and then we've got the little journal in the middle so that is it then guys that's my project like I said I'll leave links to all the kits in my description and I'll get this video up as soon as I can and then you can watch it and you can have a look if you want to go and get any of it if you want to have a go next video will probably be the christmas card one the kits from the christmas cards 
um, yeah we'll probably do that one next so as always guys thank you so much for spending some time with me today have a lovely day take care and I'll see you all soon bye